Swing time, golf app, scent swing time. We're looking at a very common grip issue, certainly with new golfers, this one, which then creates some pretty funky impact kind of shapes on a 2D camera. Um, let's talk about how grip can really influence those and then maybe how you should grip it to improve the way you strike the ball rather than try and improve that position to your impact position, if you like, how you deliver the club with a fault that's gonna make it almost impossible. Let's show you what I mean. Let's get stuck in. Okay, so swing here, we see, um, you don't really see it on the camera, but I see the club just going right through the top of the middle of the palm, not through the fingers at all. Club goes back, it's almost a turn towards the target with her body as she comes to hit the ball. And then the big picture down at impact is right hands delivered very much towards her right leg or in line with her right leg as the club wants to move forwards. Why does that happen? Why or would you try and fix that now? Again, it's that use of loft or use of the twist around this axis coming from the way she holds it. So what I mean is the way she holds it makes it very easy for her to deliver the club with a face a little bit twisted open to a path. So pointing right of, say, if she swung on a straight path. So she put a little bit of turn around the axis of this shaft in to open up or to uh, add more loft to that face or open it to a zero point here. But obviously as the club swings, there's no, that point's constant and this face is always opening to that point and always closing to that point. So she puts this twist in because of the way she holds it as she moves back. As she comes down and hit the ball now, she cannot deliver with that twist in, that club turning like that. So pointing to the right, if I'm aiming, say, at that ball, the only way to get that face, say, back to pointing at a ball is I can put an opposite twist back in, which is very difficult to do when the force is pulling on the club. Uh, she just wants to do that. She wants to pull the handle back, deliver more loft. Often it makes them hit up at the ball. They hit a lot of tops. Ball goes along the floor. Really, all built around the fact that very common, that she wants to hold the club up there. We need to get it much more in the base of these, of the palm, top of the fingers. Much stronger way of holding the club, which will allow you to use your wrists in a different manner, let you use your forearm in a different manner. Um, and it allow you to put some different forces on the club, which might allow you to get some kind of bit more speed into the ball and also change angle of attacks through a little bit more force applied as well. So look, let's go um, grip first. Why do people grip this way? <coughs> it's so common. Club sits at this angle. People put their hand down next to it, so it naturally sits right through the middle of my palm, and then they just grab it. They're told to see the right amount of knuckles, which I'm seeing here. This club is so high in my palm, I literally feel like I've got no strength in it, so I'm going to use my body the way she does to try and get it above my head. Then as she comes to hit the ball, body goes this way. So the club face is going to be pointing right of a straight path, let's say she's swinging on. She doesn't want to go right. So she's constantly in the downswing, so we're about here trying to get that club to overtake her hands. Rather than the impact, we'd like to see a little bit more head and hands lining up, handle maybe even slightly forward with an iron. Great drill for you. First of all, you've got to get the club. Try this one. You can do it two ways. I do it with this with students. Parallel to your feet line, leading edge of the club up to the sky. So not twisted down, not twisted up. Left hand down by the club, lining it up with the base of my fingers, grab it. Thumb pointing just down the right of center. That puts the correct positioning in the hand. You can do it at a right angle with the club up in the air. So I need to align the leading edge still to my target, so not twisting it to the right or to the left. Hand out in front. See, I've got it at a right angle to my left arm. Go right down through the middle of the fingers, grabbing, popping it down. That will feel very twisted and very odd for people after they've gripped it where they do. Doesn't matter which way. That way tends to be a bit more successful for people. They tend not to do it as much. This way is successful, but they do do it more. That way is more successful achieving the right grip each time. This one seems to be, and I don't know why, this one seems to be more successful getting them to do it before every shot. This one, they kind of forget to do it. Um, I actually prefer this one. So you've got the club parallel to your feet line, parallel to your ball to target line, leading edge of the club up to the sky, hands straight down at the, uh, the ground, fingers down, don't go like this. I'll put it back through the middle of your palm. Once you've got that grip in that position, you need to literally just hit some shots, see how it changes. Other things you could try doing as well, which would be quite an interesting experiment for you, to try and learn a few more feels around this twist. Do the grip more with the club pointing, say, 25 degrees, toe end off to the top left as I look here, which will be your top right of the viewfinder. Still parallel ball to target line and feet line. 
feet, a hand still in the same place, but putting it on the club now with this twisted. And then as you bring that club down to the ball, it's going to be pointing way left. Drill, game, not allowed to hit the ball left from here. Got to hit it out towards target or to the right. To do that, you're going to have to move weight across or pressure across onto your left foot. Handle delivered forward, you're going to have less loft, which will deliver a different handle position if you want to control where the face is pointing as you strike the ball. There are two, or well, that's one great drill to use to try and change the way you hit the ball, all built around a slightly different hold. Hope that helps. Thanks for sending a swing. Um, Good luck. Hope you uh, enjoy the game and get playing. We need more women golfers playing. Great to see. Thanks for watching. Post comments down below. As always, speak to you soon. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for loads more videos. Find me on Instagram at CrossfieldMark. Also on Twitter at 4GolfOnline. Find me on Facebook, Mark Crossfield. Thanks for watching. Post comments as always and see you soon.